COVID-19 is still evolving, and scientists are keeping close tabs on NB.1.8.1, a substrain detected in China last month, and now it's circulating in the Bay Area. It has been reported in Europe, and it's been reported here in the U.S. We've seen it here in our wastewater. We've seen it here in California in wastewater. So it's around. Experts at the University of California at Berkeley say the good news is this strain does not appear to be more virulent, but it does look to be more contagious. It appears to be able to attach to the receptor sites on our cells more avidly, with greater ability, which may mean that it's more transmissible which would not be good news. That could be factored into decisions about an upcoming COVID booster, even as vaccine access is being restricted, with the Health and Human Services Secretary now removing the vaccine from the CDC's immunization schedule for pregnant women and healthy children. We know that if you're vaccinated during pregnancy, those antibodies that mom develops pass through to the baby and protect the infants and the very young children uh, up to about six months of age from COVID. So all of this protection is being lost by this decision.